Kwame Brown, get your ass over here, Kwame Brown. Kwame Brown. Fujiano. So anyways, Fujiano, 1017 rapper, Fujiano has basically got arrested now again. I know I did the story before about him, like, allegedly burning off his ankle monitor, taking it off the windstone, and him being on the run. So yeah, we're going to get into this real quick, but before I do that, hey, I subscribe, help your boy, I help your boy grow, you know what it is, you know I'm the kid, K is so sick, you hear me? K is so good, he sleep with a cut up, but turn on the turn, hey, anyways, I'm going to get into this shit, but like I said, like, subscribe, show your baby mama, your baby sister, your uh, phone them, phone them baby mama, sister, nephew, just share, share my shit, you hear me, help your boy, I help your boy grow, I'm done with this, bitch. shout out to the mob, we trying like a navy, you know, I fuck with my subscribers and shit, and get in the comments, talk your little shit with me real quick, you know what I'm saying? I hope y'all like my slur, by the way. Hey, I'm sorry. <laughs> but anyways, we're going to read this shit verbatim. So, after reportedly be burning off his ankle bracelet and heading on the run, 1017 rapper Fulgiano has been arrested uh, arrested in Memphis. So, Gucci Man signee of t uh, the new 1017 or 1017, whatever the fuck you want to call it. I don't know why he let go of Young Ma and Quill. I, th I thought he should have kept them. But anyways, Fujiano made headlines in December. Oh, that was December? Following the news that he had burned off his ankle monitor and proceeded to head on the run. Months later, XXL has confirmed that the rapper was arrested in Memphis with police charging him with being a fugitive from justice without a warrant. Upon his arrest, he was booked into the Shelby County Jail. Okay. It should be noted that Fujiano was originally wearing an ankle monitor following a previous arrest for possession of a firearm by a convicted felon. The arrest was a violation of his prob probation which he received following a prior charge in, bur in burglary in 2015. Shortly after receiving the ankle bracelet, authorities discovered it discarded on alongside the Broward County Highway with the straps being visibly burnt off. At this time, it is unclear as to whether Fujiano's attempt to evade justice will bear significant legal, legal consequences. I am, cannot talk today for the rising uh, rapper. Though Fujiano's team has yet to make a statement on the current situation, many have expressed concern that these rising charges will derail the 1017's rapper rapidly rising momentum. We'll be sure to keep you updated with Fujiano's situation. Blah blah blah. Yo, double XO did their thing. They got a mugshot of this nigga as well. Now, if you're wondering why Fujiano is probably in Memphis, his fellow 1017 signee and probably friend Poo Shiesty, who I also covered, he recently lost his brother because his brother lost a fight with to brain cancer. You know what I'm saying? I'll probably put that video on the end screen if you want to know. But anyways, that happened. So they recently buried him, which probably was yesterday or two days ago, and. You know, probably Fujiano went to support his brother and also to support his friend and his label man. And also, uh, maybe him and uh, Pooh Shiesty's brother. Uh, it was cool. They had a little connection. It was cool. So maybe he also went to go pay his respects as well. Not only to the family, but to the member of the family that sadly has passed away. So, so maybe he was there. And I'm speculating at this point because that's probably why he was in Memphis. But maybe he was there. He was doing his thing. And then, yeah. They knew he was going to be there. The police knew he was going to be there. And they came and they scooped him up. Because that's the only thing that kind of makes sense. Now, this is the thing. We have seen early in December when he was on the run. I was like, what the fuck? And to me, this nigga doesn't give a fuck. I don't know if this nigga just like, yo, bro. I'm the realest street dude in the world. This motherfucker be going on IG every day. I seen this motherfucker shooting videos. This motherfucker posting and doing promo and shit. He be on IG live and shit. I'm just like... Aren't you supposed to lay low when you're on the run, my nigga? Everybody trying to be a take care. Fuck a beat. I was trying to be the case. But I ain't beat that case, bitch. I did the race. But every nigga trying to be a take care. Every nigga trying to run the marathon. Hey, do what it is. But, hey. At some point, motherfuckers gonna catch up with you. Everything catch up with you from time to time. You know what I'm saying? And it's crazy. At this point, like, I really ain't got nothing to say. Now, I'm just looking at this dude like, what the f Is this the realest goon? from like i'm just confused at this point and it kind of fucking sucks because bro he's been building he's been going up he's been going up and honestly me even listening to the new 1017 tape like him and Pooh shiesty were fucking standouts you know i fuck with my nigga roll boy that's another nigga i, I fuck with and i fuck with enchanting i'm happy she on the label as well but those two was fucking standouts on that on that fucking tape so like the fact that he getting locked up as well is crazy especially with the grind that fucking um 
push size design i don't know if big 30 is signed to 1017 i don't know yet but like the grand push ice is on right now the hit wave he's ice is on and like just him the momentum he's getting and his shit keep going up and up and up like yeah it's a bad time to get locked up we seen like i remember with boosie when he got locked up when he was going crazy in this shit it was like damn and he came out it didn't hit the same because he was in jail too long you know so some yeah like again there's no like um information on his bond or whatever the fuck and who knows what the fuck is gonna happen because again apparently he violated probation i don't know if they're gonna keep him in there for a minute i don't know what the fuck's going to happen i don't know if this motherfucker was doing shows i get well with the pandemic probably not but at the same time imagine wanting to go do a show and be on the run w would the police not just be there and lock your ass up like imagine Imagine just having that confidence like, yeah, I know I'm on the run, but book me for sure. Book me for Summer Jam. Book me for all this shit, man. I'll go do all that stuff. You know what I'm saying? You know who I am? I'm Pooh Shasta. I'm Kwame. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not Pooh Shasta. I'm Fujiano. You know who I is? I'm Fujiano, nigga. I burnt out my ankle brace and I'm still doing my shit, nigga. I'm Kwame Brown, nigga. Kwame Brown. Nigga. Hey. 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 But hey, at the end of the day, I don't know what the fuck happened. It is what it is. I don't know. Hey, free dude. Free dude. Hey, that's all I could say. I really just want to know the ankle monitor. Because I'm like, why the fuck did you really burn this shit? Like, what was happening? What was going on with you that you like, yo, fuck it. I'm just going to burn this shit off. Fuck all this other shit. But hey, bro. Free, bro. It sucks because he really got momentum now and he's getting locked up. But hey, hopefully he get out of that bitch. He does whatever the fuck he has to do to get off his probation. And he just comes on and has a career because a lot of people probably depend on him and his family and stuff. You know, he probably take care of a lot of people. So you getting locked up, you can't take care of them people. And sadly, if it's some shit where they got to go back and start doing illegal things or go back on the block. Or if you're trying to remove people from the block and sadly pass away, I'm not seen as your fault. But could have tried to help and benefit a nigga, you know what I'm saying? But anyways, I see my little piece. I went on my little spill. And I'm out for this thing. You know what it is. It's K.A. Hey, like, subscribe, share, do all that little shit. And I'm out for this. Alright, slime, zoom, peace, y'all. Alright.